Hi, with out of box AEM or the plain instance of AEM, this adaptive forms are not available. You have to install a add-on package for the adaptive forms. If you go to AEM home screen means here and you go to the forms, you will see two options here. If you go to the forms and documents and try to create a new form, let's say, uh, close this and you try to create a new form, adaptive form, you will find here no template available and what's the reason because the feature is not available with your plain AEM instance. So you have to download a add-on package as per your AEM instance from the package share. Once you install that then this feature will be available to you. So what you have to go, you have to go to the share, package share and you have to search for add-on packages and these if you can filter from here itself just go to the forms versions i would say 6.5 all software and you can these this add-on is different for different operating system so let's say i'm on mac so i should choose mac and these much of add-ons packages are available there are add-on packages services service pack so you have to install add-on packages so if you check here there are a number of add-on packages are available so as per your need whatever your aem instance is based on your aem instance you can install it so i uh, right now i'm running 6.5.10 it's not mandatory to have exact same version of this add-on package but try to use it same okay so let's say these are for mac only if i need for windows or linux uh, let's say for windows these are available for windows okay so let me have it for mac and because i'm using 6.5.10 i will install this okay just download this and you can install this to your AM. Install this package and so once you are done with the installation you have to restart your AM instance so if you don't start you might face some issues so let's restart this instance so once my package or add-on package has installed and restart is done, if you go back again to forms, you will find two additional option here, document fragment and data integration. And if you go to the forms and document, again, you will find few additional folders, folders with the existing uh, forms and other things available. So if you try to create now adaptive forms, you will find existing templates you can create your own as well but as part of this you can see right this is available now so now you can use this out of the box adobe uh, aem forms features now one more thing you need to understand here is for the initial tutorials we will be using mysql database server so we must have aem must have a connector for mysql so for that we will be installing a connector connector bundle so there's two ways how you can install one is you can add a dependency you can add a dependency this dependency if you go to the maven repository and you can check you can add this dependency in your form if you have code base and you can embed that in your package so that whenever some your package install your project package install that will be installed but because this is a one-time activity and right now for initial i don't have code base i'll show you everything over aem once we have then we'll see how we can do it so what we'll do we will manually download this and install using the system console so what i'll do because i'm using my version 8.0.29 in the same version i will install and we'll see whether this work or not so what i'll do i'll download this jar i will go to my system console and i will install that bundle okay that bundle must be in my downloads mysql connector and if i install this all right let me refresh and if i short it again it must be here if you see that my driver has been installed and in it's in active state so these two things you must know to use it initially now in coming tutorials we'll work on our actual concept means on actual adaptive forms so if you have any question please do comment